Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm just heading outside to check on my flowers. I'm sorry if this is gonna be really old because I am just really excited about those peonies. And please excuse the construction that's going on back there. Okay, so the end of my last video was yesterday. So, do you remember when those bulbs of like peonies were still like just little balls? Look at this. This is the next day. It's kind of hard to see because that guy's pointing back, but wow. Still with the ants. I don't know what's up with that. My mother-in-law said that was a common thing, so I don't know. Anyways, it's looking even more beautiful and I just can't believe it. We also have this bush, but it took much longer to grow, I guess. It must just be a newer plant. I'm sure it'll be a while before anything happens with that, but like these are just doing great. This is the first year I'm kind of learning. Like I didn't do anything to this garden. Like I said, whoever lived here before made this all beautiful, with beautiful flowers. She did a really great job. More than anything, Ken's has been the one caring for it because I've just been feeling sick and tired and trying to take care of inside of the house. The one who has been really watering and weeding this area more than I have. But yeah, that just makes me so excited. I just love those peonies. I have a problem. I am way too obsessed with these. And especially during pregnancy, it's like what I'm craving. They are ground chicken lettuce wraps. I have some salsa on it. <gasps> I forgot I have an avocado. I'm gonna add an avocado to it. I hope it hasn't gone bad yet. I was gonna try to save these for supper, but I'm just hungry. It's lunch. I don't know what else to make for lunch. I've been snacking. I'm like, well, I can't just have fruit for lunch. Yes, they're messy, but I cannot tell you how good they are. So much better. Last weekend, I was sick. Spent most of my time either on the couch or going to Father's Day gatherings. And this week, I got a migraine. So I've also just been like on the couch and there were so many things I wanted to do and I wanted to be productive and get stuff done. And it's like, I can't even function. I'm really hoping this passes soon. I'm really not trying to push it because I always do it. Nothing much to report here except the fact that I'm just ready to feel better. <laughs> it is now Monday, which means leg day. I'm just getting ready to work out. I am having a day. I'm just having a day. I'm gonna do this workout. It might not be like the best workout. I need it. So let's get into it. telling you <laughs> working out just clears my head and makes me feel so much better it's just amazing what exercise does for a person
decided to be spontaneous today and we headed to the lake. So we are officially here. We worked in the morning and then left like right at lunch. So we just got here not too long ago. It is such a beautiful day. You can never predict the kind of weather you're going to get around here. So last minute is kind of what you have to do if you want to get a good day at the beach. But Ken's and I came and my sister-in-law, so we are going to hang out at the beach until it cools off a little bit later on and then just kind of explore. There's just a town full of little shops. It's really, really cute. We will go explore that when it cools off a little bit. It's just so nice to be here. I haven't been to the lake in what feels like forever. Definitely before like winter. Spontaneous times out are sometimes the best. Ken's told me to grab the frisbee and now I'm not sure where it is. I'm also a schmuck because I forgot my camera. That's why this is super close up. I'm sure it's over here. quickly showered. I am going to just wash some dishes because I got sand stuck in my water bottle. But obviously I got way too much sun and I did not mean to do that. I always underestimate how much sun you can get from just being in the water. Like I did not feel hot. I don't know. Here I'm burning like my whole line and I can just see my eyes, cheeks, nose. I mean, I burn very easily on my face, but I totally forgot to use my sunscreen on my face. But even still, I still ended up burning. Whoops, it's so close to bedtime. I am wiped out. It was so, so fun. I am so glad we did that. But now I'm just ready for a good night's sleep. I'm just trying to get some editing done before my company arrives. I'm super excited. My cousin and her kiddos are coming over just to hang out. <laughs> I guess when my cousin's three-year-old woke up this morning, the first thing he said was, are we going to Neil's house today? And I just thought that was so cute. He calls me Neil because he didn't know how to say Danielle when he was young, so Neil just kind of stuck. And I really hope he never stops calling me that because it is so cute. But I am going to end the vlog here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.